Wait, so it just stops there? Okay. Well, guys, welcome to a brand new Pokemon Let's Play. This is Pokemon Uranium version. It is a completely fan-based game. Don't worry, this is not an official game. And if you're wondering why, it goes a little back to Diamond and Pearl graphics. Uh, it's kind of hard to make 3D graphics on a fan game, so... Don't worry, these graphics are still really awesome. So this game contains over a hundred new Pokemon, containing, I think you saw some of them in the intro, and uh, you can see one flashing on screen right now. Um, yeah, there's Mega Evolution in this game, which is cool, and yeah, it's completely fan-based, and uh, I think that's enough to say. I did do a practice game. I only got up to where I chose my Pokemon, and um, I don't know actually how m to play this game much, except for running around and stuff. So, it says press space to continue. So let's do this. As you can see, there's my practice game. I got one of my protection. So, um, I've already changed my options around as I want, and uh, I guess let's click new game. We are not playing a Nuzlocke. Don't even, like, if I click Nuzlocke mode, I would literally cry because I hate Nuzlocke. I mean, they're really fun, but I usually die in the next 10 minutes. I do kind of want to see how it works, though. So when this series is done, hopefully if we finish it, uh, be sure to uh, hold on and maybe we'll be going through in the Nuzlocke mode. Who knows, but for now, we're going to stick to regular mode. Yes, I'm sure I want to play on this mode. Huh? What's up, kid? Oh, that's right. You're that kid who's applying for the job, right? Yep, definitely. Well then, I'm Ernest Bambo. Or I guess you can call me Professor Bambo if you want. Want the lowdown on what you'll be doing? Uh, no. Need any help? Um, no, I don't think I need any help. I've played plenty of other Pokemon games. So it looks like we get to see one of those cute little new fake Pokemon. Yay. But they're actually really cool, and they have like a whole Pokedex on the website for it, which is really cool. We humans share this world with creatures known as Pokemon. More than mere animals, Pokemon possess untold powers over the elements and remarkable intelligence. People in Pokemon coexist in many ways. Some Pokemon are kept as pets, others help us with work, and still others are used in battle by trainers such as yourself. But we don't know everything about them yet. That is my job. I'm the regional, perhaps worldwide, expert on Pokemon elements. Why do they exist? Why do they have strengths and weaknesses? Ah, but tell me this is your first day on the job. Yeah, no, it's definitely my first day. Report to my lab this morning to get your start of Pokemon. Now, if you would fill out this form here. Alright, are you a boy or are you a girl? I'm a boy, thank you very much. Now, what did I say my name was? I said my name was Flam. Flame. Even though I never said my name, so I don't know how you would ask me. So, let's go ahead and click OK. But this music is really good. Tips to the music editor. <laughs> so you're Flame. Flame, are you ready? Your journey, your story, is about to unfold. The future is a blank sight. You and your Pokemon are going to try and complete this game and not die. Together with your Pokemon, you are going to fill it. There will be challenges and thrills that will most likely lead you to death, and you're bound to make exciting discoveries. Get ready. Ten years ago, Lucille, Flame's mother, was the manager of Tandor's third nuclear power plant. There was a slight mechanical malfunction. They were in the process of making repairs when... Nice work, mates. Okay, break time. I'll fetch us all some lunch. 
I'd like a cheeseburger. And what about you? Um, I don't think we have time for a break right now. It looks like there's something wrong in the power room. It looks like the system is overheating! What's going on? It's going to explode! Everybody! Out! Get out! Run! Oh wait, I did that in mom's voice. Why, why did he take his time? Why, no, like literally, why did that guy take his time? Most of the age just barely escaped with their lives before they seal. They never found her body. Oh come on, she was like the first one out or something. After that day, Flame's father, a famous Pokemon ranger, don't be weird if we had a Pokemon for a dad, left his house to travel the region secretly searching for his wife. Since then, you lived with your aging great aunt in a small town known as Maki. You grew up there until your aunt, now retired, could no longer support a 13-year-old. Your father negotiated with Professor Bambo, an old friend of his, to give you a job as a Pokemon trainer. Now the time has come for you to leave home. Flame! Come downstairs! You are late! For what? What am I late for? Well, looks like we don't start off with running shoes. That's a bummer. What is this? I so need to get a new game system. Wait. What am I saying? I already have a Wii. Duh! Why would I need a new game system? I got a Wii. Look at this beautiful carpet. What's on TV? What's on TV? It's TV. It's showing a Pokemon battle. Ooh, it's an Onyx! Okay. Do we want to check the computer? Let him boot it up the PC. What do you want to do? Item storage. Withdraw item. Ah, oh, potion! How awesome. Well... Okay, okay. Let's talk to this map. It's the town map. Well, that's cool. It's like the whole... It's the whole map. Wow. Yeah, that is really cool. Um... So, uh, yeah, let's exit the map and, uh, wait, 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 we hit our head through the wall. That's a pretty funny glitch. The wardrobe, this is where my aunt sleeps. Just kidding. This? There's a framed embroidery. Home is where the heart is. And there's a heart underneath it. Why is there a heart underneath it? It's a widescreen TV. I like to watch it while eating dinner. I don't even think my my little eyes can see from over here. I can't I can't face diagonally, so I can't I can't really see it. Unless I sit right here. But what about grandma? Is she gonna have to like turn like go around behind me? Eh, whatever. Looks like we got some coffee. Cup of Joe is on the table. Cup of Joe Flame, oh flame, I'm so sorry. Oh why do you gotta go? No, don't answer that. I know perfectly well why. Oh, if these old bones could do more of that, I could support the both of us. But let's not dwell on the past. Here, I brought you some new shoes for your journey. Wear them well. Oh, we do get the running shoes. And a kiss. Aww. Tap the hoodie. Go, sweetie, and best of luck if you're lost. Ask someone around town. But you can call me, alright? Bye, honey. Okay. Well, let's head outside into Maki Town. So, um, wow. That's a well-designed GUI. For an original fan game, that is a really good GUI. In the preview thing, it did not show you here. What do you have to say for yourself? I wonder what kind of Pokemon lives in this pond. Probably just Magikarp. Uh, you would be surprised. Hello? Man, that's an annoying sound. Oh, Flame, you're leaving home right here. Have this, it'll help you on your journey. Don't eat it yourself. I just, like, changed his voice, like, six times in the middle of the sentence. Okay. Flame, put the rare candy in the medicine pocket. Okay, I'm not gonna go in the house yet, because it's bigger. We'll go in small houses first, unless they're all that size, but this one isn't, so... Can we talk to their Joe? We cannot talk to their Joe. What about you? What do you have to say? Bet you wish you heard of it sooner, huh? 
chores. I don't know what. It's almost impossible to get Junior to help me with the ch chores anymore. Hey, did you know that they've made this new video game that lets you play with po as a Pokemon trainer without the danger and boringness? It's called Pokemon Red Version! <gasps> Guys, I never knew that! I literally never knew that. What's over this way? Route 3 ahead. It's a rugged rock, but a Pokemon may be able to smash it. Well, we don't got no Pokemon, so... Let's look at this sign. Monkey Town! Town of five citizens. Why only five? Here, I'm gonna go around and count all the citizens. Okay, so there's one fisherman, there's me. There's that random boy walking around, there's that girl. Wait, so there's the fisherman. Me. These two people. My aunt. That's already five. That random girl. That random boy. I think the professor lives here. Um. Is that it? That's like eight. That's already eight. And there's... Probably more. This is not the town of five citizens. This game lied. Um, can we go in any other houses? What about over here? It's too dangerous to go out without a Pokemon. Well, sorry. Wait, so road to Kel Kevlar Town and Mucky Town. We're in Mucky Town. Mucky! What's up here? Bamboo Pro Pokemon Research Lab. Oh, cool! That's like one of the starters, I think. That one looks cool. I kind of want that one. Don't know, though. What? Did we already go in this house? No, we didn't. <clears throat> Sorry if I'm a, I'm a little sick right now. Hey, Flames! Are you finally heading out on an adventure? Good to hear it, kid. Don't forget to visit every once in a while, though. My husband has always been a big fan of your father, did you know? Nope, didn't. Can I sleep in your bed? I like beds. But why is this, like, random bed placed in the middle of the room? That doesn't even make sense. Uh, I don't think we should go to the room. I think there's... Is there more to the city? Did we already talk to this woman? My daughter is now a trainer, did you know? She's training her chi in monk uh, in Route 1. Say hi to her if you see her. Chi in monk. Is that even... That's one of the fake Pokemon, but man, that's a weird name. Not saying it's a bad name. Cam. Hey, Flame, I heard you were getting your first Pokemon today. Theo was really excited about that, you know? Yeah, I guess. Wait, we do it here, too. We hit our head against the sideboard. I'm so excited about today! Mainly the part where I get a better Pokemon than you. Hee <laughs> hee. Look, he's like half the height of me, and he's getting a Pokemon the same time as me. This is not... This is not right. Wow. Wow. Wow, game. You had to give a seven-year-old a Pokemon when I'm 13? Silly. Today is a nice day. Seems like it always is around here. Uh, for some reason, I think that the people have different dialogue. No, this guy has the same dialogue. Maybe if I go back in this house or something. No, wait. Maybe this house. Maybe this kid... My Charmeleon's level 28 already. What level is your Pokemon, huh? I think he's talking about the game that he really likes. So, If he had a Charmeleon in real life, then I would be really sad because he looks like younger than 7. He looks like 6. So, oh, looks like the last place to go is over here. Professor Bamboo's Research Lab. So it looks like these are the three starters. I kind of want the middle one. That one looks cool. It looks like it has like a lightning bolt. But that one's so cute, it looks like one of those Japanese cat thingies. Not to be offensive. But that's kind of what it looks like. Whoa, that music's loud! But man, that's pretty cool music. Good luck on your test! Oh, wait, now we have to take a test. Oh, great! We have to take a test. Oh, hey! Oh, I forgot my what voice I did with him! Oh, hey, Flame. It's today, isn't it? Your big day, so to speak. But it's not just yours, of course. There's one other kid, isn't there? Oh, that, that music. That deep music. Dang it, you got here first! Uh, you're, um, Tom, is it? Honestly, Pops, can't even remember my name. I'm Thea! Thea! Remember it! Um, right, sorry, Thea. Th Theo. Theo. I can't, can't see the Thea. If 
you don't know who Thea is, she's one of my friends that I have Minecraft Survival, but that's kind of weird. Okay. You don't know Thea, don't you? He's your friend, um, from when you were kids. You do recognize him, don't you? Hey, Professor, I'm kind of getting tired of waiting. Let's take a test already. Oh, right. Right, the test. Yeah, you will both take this test at the same time. It should be kind of fun, actually. Er, wait one second. What's on the test, anyway? Oh, right, right. This test consists of questions that serve to determine what kind of trainer you are. Since different starter Pokemon are suited for different types of trainers, we'll be able to find which one best suits you. Wait, so we don't get to choose our starter? Actually, I think maybe, maybe he gives us an idea and then we choose it ourselves. So, yeah. Are, am I ready for taking it? No, not quite yet. Okay, we'll be waiting here. Come back quickly. Okay, I just need to run in circles a bunch of times. Get my brain up. Am I supposed to be able to go into the wall? Some papers are pinned up on the wall. Protect your Pokemon. Using potions. Your one-stop source for Pokemon info. The window gives you a lovely view on the rocky wall. There's nothing to see. I can go in walls, people! Yay! Best glitch ever? Uh, let's... Professor Bambo won't like it if you were, if you figured out you were playing with this Pokeball. But I think this is a good place to end off the video. Next time we're gonna take our test and hopefully get to choose our Pokemon starter. It's a big green machine. Heck, if I know what it did. Well, um, this guy say good luck on your test. Uh, well, I hope you guys did enjoy this brand new Pokemon Uranium series. If you, uh, the next episode will be coming out. I think next week? I don't know. Hexit and this are going to be like alternating. So, uh, be sure to watch out for that. And, uh, 